Okay, so remember in module two, we talked about how you don't need a user account to file your annual report using Express Filing. I, yes, I do. Mm -hmm. You don't remember that, do you? No, but I do now that you said it. So. I've been busy, make, look, making scones here, which by the way, go great with a cup of Starbucks coffee. You know, I'm glad you mentioned that. Say you want to keep an eye on Starbucks' filings using CCFS. I actually would like to keep up with Starbucks' filings on CCFS. Well, in order to do that and have access to some of the other information and reports, mm -hmm. you'll need a user account. Okay. But like the rest of the site, it's simple. To create a user account, you'll start at the CCFS launch screen. First, click Create a User Account on the right-hand side of the page. Next, click on the Continue button under the section title User Account. A pop-up screen will appear here. Click on Individual as your account type, then click Continue. Enter a user ID and password of your choice, and then click Continue. The next page will be the Contact Information page. Enter the appropriate information in the boxes and then click Continue. The next page will be the Address page. Enter the appropriate information on this page and then click Register. You'll just need to check your email and click the link to activate your user account. You will then see a confirmation page that your user ID has been successfully created with the corporations and charities filing system. On this page, you will see your ID listed. If you click the sign in button, you will be redirected to the customer login page. Here, you can enter your newly created user ID and password and then click login. This will take you to the home screen when you log in and you're done. Once you've logged in, you'll see a variety of items on your dashboard. One of those is the My Subscriptions tab, which allows you to follow businesses and receive updates when they file with the Secretary of State. Let's subscribe to Starbucks by searching them in the Add Subscriptions tab. That's it. Now you'll receive a notification anytime Starbucks files. Once again, super easy. Yeah. Starbucks, if you guys wanna subscribe to me on CCFS, you know, that's fine. I'm cool with that. I'm sure they'll get right on that. It's like a social media for business records. Very exciting stuff. Matt's Bakery, follow me on CCFS. <laughs> Not exact. You know what? You're having fun. I am. Let's go with it. In the next modules, we'll go over a few report filing flows. Let's do it. <laughs>